video three is going to be about strengthening the plaster mold that we've created in the previous two videos. All you need to get started is a block of clay. Now this is this is a water-based clay. You can get oil-based clay. Oil-based clay takes a lot long, longer to dry. It doesn't crack as much as the water-based clay, but it dries a lot quicker and it's easy to repair if, if it cracks well, it will crack if and when it cracks you just get some moist pieces of fresh clay and fill in the cracks but the, the whole point of the clay is to make it so the plaster mold doesn't get crushed easy it's just building a nice foundation for it to handle so that's all that we're going to be doing in video three is is fortifying this plaster mold just a lot of preparation here And that clay is going to take about a week to dry. And like I said, if you use the water-based, um, it's going to it's going to crack. It's just inevitable with the water-based. You'll have to fill in the cracks. And you don't have to bake it or anything. Just let it air dry. But it needs at least a week. After a week, it's going to be all cracked and you'll be like, oh no, what's wrong? You know, the, the, the gaps are going to be like quarter inch, a good centimeter crack. So you just go and fill it in with, with fresh clay and I'll, I'll show you what happened with that in the next video. But you kind of don't have any choice because if you, if you use the oil-based clay, it's just, it's not going to dry. It's take forever. And you can see on both pieces, I've cut those pieces of clay about three quarter inch thick. And both pieces will be 
pretty heavy by the time you're done with it, but that's good. You want a nice, strong, heavy, solid structure. And just need to smooth it on now. Make it all nice and uniform so it fits nice and tight onto the plaster. And there you have it. It's just a lot of a lot of busy work. This step uh, took about a little over an hour to do. So, so so far we're you know each each video is about an hour's worth of work. So we're three hours in now at this point in work. The hardest part is just waiting for everything to dry. And once again, just making the, the edges smooth so it sits up nicely against the other, the other mold. And then you can see right there, I pressed it down on the paper so, so that clay will be flat. And there you go, you can see more or less there. There, there, that's what you want. That's what it'll look like in the end. So I just want to thank you for watching video three. Um, be sure to check out video four where you get to see basically the repair phase, of fixing the cracks and everything and getting it ready to, to paint and then get ready to fill in the latex.